open blinds. Good morning, Adam. You have one new message. From? David Sarif. <sighs> Play it. Adam, it's David. I know it's been a while, but uh, after what happened in Prague yesterday... Look, son, whatever reasons you had for not getting in touch these last two years, well, life's too short. I'm leaving for London soon, but uh, give me a call. You saved his vid call number? Yes, Adam. Just activate your TV system.
Adam! Thanks for calling me back, son. Seraph. I heard about the bombing in Prague. It's all over the news. Did anyone you know get hurt? You know me. I tend to keep to myself. I'm surprised you even know I'm here. Interpol called me when you applied for the job, part of their extensive background checks. I gave you a glowing recommendation. Thanks. What do you want? What do I want? Jeez, Adam! I know I did some questionable things in the past, but a lot's happened in the last two years. To both of us. That's true. For what it's worth, I'm glad you made it out of Panchea. Thank you. It wasn't easy, as I'm sure you know. It was a death's door by the time the rescue crews pulled me out of the wreckage. And while the doctors were stitching me back together, my company fell apart. There wasn't anything I could do to stop it, not from a hospital bed. I heard Tai Young Medical bought everything up. They're the only biotech corporation that could, after the incident. Our patents, our tech, everything. Oh well, sometimes one dream has to die so another can rise from its ashes. You heard anything from Megan? <sighs> After all we went through, I thought she'd stand by me. Still, you know, she always wanted to be at the cutting edge. She didn't see a future for herself in Detroit, so she went to VersaLife. She moved to Hong Kong? San Francisco. They've got an offshore research facility there named Rokaseka Beach. I'm sure you've seen it in the news. California, huh? I wonder if she's told her mother. You want my advice, son? Write her out of your life. Because I'm damn sure she's written us out of hers. You talked to Pritchard lately? Frank! <laughs> Out of all of us, I think he's the one who's changed the least. He'd probably tell you there wasn't anything about him that needed changing. I'm sure he would. But when the world transforms itself the way ours has, people need to adapt or get left behind. Frank's freelance now, but he's still in computer security, still in Detroit. I don't know if he'll ever leave. Your message said you were going to London. Casual trip? Or is this tied to the new dream? I'm, uh, meeting with the Santo group. Nathaniel Brown and his investors. Santo? They built the Udalek complex, the Og Ghetto, here in Prague. Why are you meeting with them? Brown's got big plans. He wants to focus on real solutions, ideas that look to the future. Y you've heard of the Safe Harbor Initiative? I've heard of Rabia. The walled city he and his company are building in the desert for Augs. Be is just a part of it. We're talking about self-sustaining, energy-efficient arcologies that can be replicated anywhere on Earth. Cities built by the augmented for the augmented. Where the dream of self-controlled human evolution lives on. It may not seem like it right now, son, but one day, people will move on from the incident. And when that happens, we'll be ready for it. I'm glad we caught up, Adam. I've always tried to look out for you, you know. That bombing yesterday. You didn't call to talk about the bombing. Just ask. It's nothing, really. I, I just need a signature so I can finish filing the bankruptcy paperwork. You need my signature? Yeah, apparently there was some kind of bureaucratic mix-up caused by you being declared legally dead for a year. The apartment in Detroit was leased in your name even though we paid for it. Fine. Send me the paperwork. Thanks, Adam. I appreciate it, really. Goodbye, Seraph.
It's Jensen. It's good to finally hear from you, Agent. You doing okay? Sorry about the downtime. I'll get to the office as soon as I can, but my augs took a hit during the attack. I need to get them looked at. Of course. There's a lot of work ahead of us, Jensen. I'll see you when you get in. Dr. Kohler, I need to pay you a visit. Jensen! Now's actually a really good time for me, like right now! Something wrong? There are some guys in my bookshop. Pissed off the valley gangster looking guys. So, unless you want bloodshed the day after a terror attack... The front door isn't the most peaceful option. I got it.